the new curriculum is, 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 is on its way to destruction. The Kenya National Union of Teachers Secretary General Wilson Sosion has said that the 26333 curriculum was rolled out without following the due process, adding that teachers were not adequately trained. How would you roll out a new curriculum without a session of paper? We have not passed a session of paper in Parliament. There is no policy framework. Teachers have not been trained. Teachers have not been trained. The stories from TSC and Ministry are pure lies. Our teachers have been properly trained to roll out this new curriculum. He says that President Uhuru Kenyatta is being misadvised on the way forward in the ongoing education reforms by individuals who have selfish commercial interests and no concern for the welfare of children. The advice by Amina was right. Sosion, who was speaking in Latin High School, Kericho County, during the Nat Bureti branch AGM, also pointed out that they will release a report next week on the competency-based curriculum, which is now being implemented from pre-primary 1 to grade 3 in public schools nationwide. Meanwhile, a section of teachers in Mandera County want the government to relook afresh into the issue of delocalization, claiming that the move will disenfranchise the already fragile education system sector in the country. Led by the Kenya National Union of Teachers Mandera branch, the teachers claim that the transfers were part of a scheme by the Teachers Service Commission to silence those agitating for the rights of teachers. Whatever we are demanding, we are demanding it within the law. And it is on this premises that we want to tell the Teacher Service, Commission, Teacher Service Commission to withdraw the statement against enjoying the same rights. For Channel 1 News, I'm Safin Aching Oma.